Hey guys, welcome to week two of online learning. So hopefully you got your um, feet wet with it a little bit last week. Hopefully this week will be even better. Um, third period particularly, I apologize about our Zoom meetings. Hopefully we'll get that issue resolved this week. Um, but I just wanted to give you a little overview of what, what you need to do and what's coming up for this week. So um, if you look at the module, I put a schedule there. It's just a pacing guide. Again, nothing is due until midnight Sunday or I guess midnight Monday of the following week. But those dates are there just to kind of keep you um, on track and also to keep you going in sequence because if you try to skip around with this, it's not going to make any sense at all. It's very sequential. So you need to do it at least in order even if you don't do it on the day that it's due. So um, for Monday and Tuesday of this week, really there's one lesson there in the module. And um, as I kept putting things into it, it got longer and longer, and I thought this is more than one day's worth of work. So for some of you, it may not be all that much, but it's reviewing how to um, name compounds and how to write formulas. So if you felt really confident with that last year, then it may not take you that long. But some of you may have a little bit more work, a little bit more review to do, and if that's the case, I wanted you to have time to do that. So Monday and Tuesday, you're doing um, names and formulas. There's a quiz. If you get through everything on Monday and want to do the quiz Monday, have at it. If not, um, you've got until Tuesday to do that. And of course, also on Tuesday, we'll have our Zoom meetings. Um, so if you've got questions that you want to ask before you take the quiz, you'll have an opportunity to go over that and, and ask anything that you want to. Um, you're not really submitting anything. I'm looking at my notes here to make sure. Um, on that, it's just the quiz. And so I'm not checking up on you. I put some questions in there for you to try and ch kind of check yourselves. But if you do need help with that, then just let me know and we can go over some things. Um, and the reason we had to do the names and formulas review is on Wednesday, you're gonna look at writing balanced equations from a description. So we balance the equations and now um, sometimes, especially with AP, they'll just say, you know, this reaction happens and you have to be able to actually produce the equation for that reaction. So that's what we're gonna do. So you had to know how to write the formulas for that before you could actually um, do the, the equation. So that's why we're spending time Monday and Tuesday on, on that review. Then, um, so Wednesday is writing the equations. On that day, you're gonna submit um, just your work. You're gonna show me that you know how to write those equations. And so that's, that's one that I'll be looking at. Um, on Thursday, we're looking at reaction types. So we're classifying reactions. Here again is one of those things that if you had this class in the spring, you've seen some of this before. Um, probably some of the same videos that I've got uploaded for you for, for this week. If you had this class in the fall, then this is new stuff. Um, you may have come across it maybe in eighth grade, possibly seventh grade, um, but, but for the most part, it's gonna be something that's new for you. And on that day, you're just gonna have like five practice problems to tell me what kind of reaction it is, pretty simple, as well as some other practice problems before you have to actually submit anything. So again, I'm putting some practice problems there with the answer keys for you to, to kind of, you know, see how you're doing on your own. And you know, it's one of those things, guys, you can decide, you know, do I wanna do this class just to get a grade out of it? Or do I wanna do this class to really learn something out of it? And so that's, you know, that's kind of up to you. With this online format, it's it's more up to you than, than ever. So Thursday's reaction types. And then Friday, it gets really, really fun. Not so much, but I think it's fun. Um, we're doing reaction predictions, and so it's just sort of the next logical step. So we've gone from balancing equations, then um, this week you're going to be writing your own equations. Then, um, after we learn how to kind of classify and look at the different types, you're actually just going to be given reactants in an equation, and you have to figure out what the products are going to be. It's not as hard as it sounds. Those reaction types are really going to help you with that, and, um, and you'll start to see those patterns, and it'll make more sense. So... As I started doing the videos for the reaction types, again, it got long. I think it's almost 45 minutes just of, of videos of me explaining some things. And so for that reason, I went ahead and um, gave you two days for that. So um, this week technically is not going to end on Friday. So Friday, you've got all the information. Then Monday, you're going to work with it and do the problems. That's sort of the plan. Again, if, if you get through those videos and you want to go ahead and try those problems on Friday, that's really what I would suggest doing, and that way you just won't have nearly as much to do on on Monday. Then Tuesday of next week, we're going to look at net ionic equations, which is its whole 
um, whole other thing. It really falls or follows directly from what we're doing, but you'll see what that is when we get there. So really, we've got the next seven school days kind of um, underway here. And hopefully we'll be back in person. If we are, you know, that information's here online. You can still use it if you want to. Um, but for my people that are online only, it's it's there for you. And you guys can go ahead and just work through again at your own pace. Again, pacing guide is there. It's just a suggestion. Nothing is late until after midnight on the Sunday um, at the end of the week. Um, the things that are I've got scheduled for like Monday and Tuesday of next week again, they won't be due until the following week. So, so don't get too uptight if you're having trouble getting things done. Um, as always, if you need anything, just send me a message. Um, also, I just want to mention, check back and look at you know the assignments that you've submitted. Um, I'm, I don't have all of them graded at this point. I'm going to work on that here in just a few minutes. But um, I am giving you feedback and giving you some suggestions on those. So just don't forget that that's another um, resource that you have if you're wondering, well, how am I really doing on this? Um, as I as I work through, you will have some grades posted and some comments on your on the work that you're submitting. So don't forget to take a look at that. So um, I will see you in Zoom meetings this week. And just again, as always, let me know how I can help. I'll see you soon, guys.